first pitch. The record for Moeller this year. As Schreier takes the second pitch, drives it to deep left field, kiss that goodbye. Cody Schreier with his eighth home run on the year, and just like that, UCLA up 1-0. Well, if we take a look at that pitch, man, I think we're going to see that it's a, a pretty center cut fastball. And Schreier got all of it. 105 off the bat. We're just getting started here in Long Beach. Second batter walks, Jake Palmer aboard. 6-2 Junior grounds it up the middle. Could be two. Tough play at second. And everybody's safe. Looks like the step was late on the bag at second. That one's in the dirt. Gets away from Connor Burns. The throw to second is in time. So put the second out on the board for Long Beach State. However, UCLA does get a Bruin to third. Really proven it. 2013 national champions as Reyes takes a walk and Darius Perry comes up. 2-2, two -two. swing and a miss. So Moeller gets out of a runners on the corner situation, but does give up that home run to lead off the ball game. No runs, no error, or no earned runs came in as Chase Luttrell plops one into right center for Mason. Bunt shown pulled back, gets away from the catcher. I think this is just gonna be a straight pass ball. And Luttrell takes an extra bat. Does ground it off the foot of Chase Luttrell. So record the third out of the inning between second and third. And that will do it for the first. Oh, he definitely tattoos one to deep left field. Goes over the wall. No, off the wall. Off that top part of the Ayers Hotel sign. A rip to left on the first pitch. Schreier was all over it. And that is an RBI single for Schreier. Already with two RBIs in this ball game, responsible for both UCLA's runs. That is a fly ball. It's a pretty deep left, but Pretty playable for the left fielder, Pepe, and that will do it for the top half of the second. We go to the bottom half, still just 2-0. Two, 2-1 two now, the count to Tyler White. Sprays it to right, and then just drops in front of the right fielder, Curiel. And that is a two-out base hit. The bag's in there, right back in it. Runner goes, swing and a miss. So that'll do it for the fifth. We go to the sixth, still 2-0 UCLA. That's driven to left. Back goes Pepe, and it's over the wall this time. A home run, 3-0 UCLA. Darius Perry with his second home run on the year. 15 RBIs now. And the catcher showing some pop. Here's another look at it, 99 off the bat. It had a lot of... Saldivar, though, able to get a one-out base hit to center. Off he goes. Chopper to short. Well, it takes the double play out of it. And Pepe safe at first on the high throw. Now 
now it's a 2-2 pitch driven to deep left center, and that is off the wall. Two-run score for the Dirtbags on a two-RBI double for Jonathan Long. Well, well you he can got say 94. third time's a charm. <laughs> he got 94. He didn't hit straight away. He got into the gap a little bit. He put Yates on his horse, and, and that was one that Yates just couldn't run down tonight. So the Bruins let the dirtbags hang around for a little bit, and guess what? They're back in the ball game. A single, an error, a strikeout, and a double, and now we're in a one-run ball game with the tying run at second base. With those two RBIs, that ties for the team lead for Jonathan Long. That was 102 off the bat, and it basically hit the top of the wall. That's about 393 feet. 3-2 offering. Swing and a miss. Huge strikeout for Luke Jewett. Two runs do come in, but UCLA gets out of this sixth inning. He is facing the seven, eight, nine hitters this inning as Tyler White sprays it to right. Off the glove of the right fielder, Curiali, and White goes to second with a one-out double. Presents as the tying run at second base with one out. Bach ruled on the mound from Jewett. So all of a sudden, Long Beach State has a runner at third. Lines it into left field, and we are tied. RBI single for Connor Burns. That is his ninth RBI on the year. And all of a sudden, Long Beach State still cooking with the top of the order coming up. One, two. Breaking ball in there. So Ethan Flanagan comes in to close out the bottom of the seventh, but not before Long Beach State brings home the Palmer had to fight that one off. Tough play, and it falls in shallow left field. Palmer to second on what I would believe is a double, a leadoff double for Jake Palmer. Down is E6, and a bunt put down by Karos. So sacrifice successful, one out with a runner on third for UCLA. That is the go-ahead run. Swing and a miss. Went to the breaking ball. Second time today that a Long Beach State pitcher has worked their way back from a 3-0 count to strike out the batter. Pitch is lined into center. Tyler White able to snag it. And we go to the bottom of the eighth. All tied up at three. It grazed the shoulder or arm of Tyler White, so that's a hit batsman. Off he goes. The throw to second. Safe. Good throw, he's under the tag though. Just safe, and his third stolen base on the year. 1-1, one, one. shows bunt, puts it down. Has to hustle to first. The throw is in time. So that'll do it for the ninth. We go to extra. 2-2. Two, two. Strike three called. And for the third time today, Kyle Carroll strikes out. And the strikeout also ends the top half of the 10. Deck there, certainly with two strikes. Big swing and a miss. Up. Strikes out the side in order. Does a lot no Treadwell. So we go to the 11. Oregon State. The one two pitch here gives him another clean inning. A strikeout of Darius Perry leads us to the bottom half of the 11. One two. Big strikeout from Treadwell again. That is now five strikeouts out of the last six outs recorded. Games like this. So does every pitch. A four-pitch walk for Ethan Gorsett. Seven, eight, nine hitters due up in this Yama. 
runner goes. Hit and run will work just for the fact that it looks like a sacrifice in the scorecard. Drive to left field on the dead run is Rocco Pepe. And no runs come aboard and come across. Going a full inning as Peyton Schultz blasts one to deep center and is gone. Just like that, the game is over. Peyton Schultz, who had not hit the ball out of the infield yet today, blasts one to straightaway center. 406 the distance, 104 off the bat, and we go home. Well, Maddie, it was exciting, that's for sure. We saw a lot of pitching. Uh, we saw very little scoring, but uh, tonight the Dirtbags came back. They showed a lot of grit, a lot of resiliency. They needed their entire team to do it tonight. Guys off the bench, guys out of the bullpen, and a huge, huge win for them against the nationally ranked UCLA Bruins.